Hello guys, Research here bringing you another Total War Warhammer replay with commentary for today. I wanted to try out the Warhammer 2, Total War Warhammer 2 again. As, um, yeah, I missed the game, I missed the old world, I missed my Dark Elves, and I have to say, I really miss land battles, the uh, regular format that we had in Total War Warhammer 1 and 2. So, as you guys saw there, we're playing as Dark Elves with the leadership of Malekith and we're going against the Empire with uh, Wokmar on top of his wagon with a steam tank and yeah, Empire in full force here. So, without further ado, let's just talk about the armies and see what we have here. We have seen this matchup a lot. Uh, I think I've uploaded, uh, this is one of the most uploaded matchups in my game so yeah why not try it again uh, so for my front line i have four units of bleak swords two dread spears two black arc corsairs i think we have two dark riders with shields with two Coban knights which uh who are being escorted uh, into the battlefield we also have two Scourge Runners, one of the strongest, uh, stronger units in the Warhammer 2. We also have the Ravagers of Rakarth, the Regiment of Renowned Scourge Runners, and Malekith who just dodged a cannon from the Steam Tank, I think. So let's see the spells and items. I think I have the Circlet of Iron, Noxious Breath, Power of Darkness, Soul Eater, and gaze of malice with stand your ground so yeah i really want to play as old world factions the warhammer 1 and 2 factions in warhammer 3 and try them out against uh, newer factions and see how they do so yes yeah, ca please uh release the mortal empires uh asap <laughs> and yeah let's just talk about the empire army let's uh no let's not uh play the game in normal speed this we're gonna get close too soon already one of my scourge runners took a lot of damage, lost a model. My opponent has a lot of spear units. I think I'm seeing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So all of them are spear units, some with shields, some without. The front line have shields. We also have two casters, one Amber Wizard with just transformation of Kadan. In the forest, we have two cav units, one Demigriff Knights with Halberds, and an Empire Knights with a Jade Wizard with uh regrowth is that regrowth or the uh, yeah regrowth here uh, as and we already saw the uh, steam tank and the walkmar also uh, let's see what he decided to bring he has benediction jade griffin let's start the game uh, banishment grand hammer grand shield and grand soul fire so yeah we have seen this matchup a lot uh it was one of the most fun uh, matchups that I had. So right here, we have Hammer of the Witches, which is a really hard counter against large targets. Uh, I'm trying to dodge. I'm trying to dodge the Manticore, Summon Manticore, and the uh, cannon shots. But uh, it's not the easiest thing to do. First of all, yeah, I'm getting friendly fired as well. <laughs> Witch King is probably not... Uh, happy right now so i'm trying to dive in here go after walk more we're probably going to be able to do some damage here but the main thing i'm trying to do is not get shot at by these cannons trying to um trying to use walk more as cover but it doesn't look too good uh malik has already took a lot of damage so i have to uh, cast my uh soul sealer uh, really soon here look at that insane amount of damage so at this stage i saw these two units and i was deciding what to do i'm gonna bring some dread spears and uh these anti-large cold one knights and dark raiders and go after them in a bit after uh, we uh, dealt with this uh, pre uh predicament here so malekith already used a soul seer i think we were able to use it on some decent units some uh, two of the uh, spearmen uh, lost some hp walk more not the uh, worst situation for him he has a lot of anti-magic i think 40 percent if i'm not mistaken yeah so he's not gonna 
worry about uh, any soul sealers there the chariots have moved in i'm trying my best to send my units around try to get this hammer of which which is uh, offline it's already i think it, it was able to accrue a lot of value here yeah already uh, pretty close at playing for themselves and i think uh yeah for, fortunately those uh, shots miss i i think i was able to dodge them there but yeah the cannon shots are relentless and i have to be really careful about them so we uh, our infantry was superior to our opponent so no surprise there we were able to break our opponent's front line still not the best situation with more walkmar and the steam tank a lot of our infantry uh, lost there but uh, malachis is really close at death's door the hammer of witches uh, shooting from a pretty close range and yeah each shot uh, it does around three to four hundred damage so i use the uh, soul stealer here on the uh, hammer of uh, the witches and fortunately we were able to finally bring this uh, dreaded artillery piece down here so yeah they're not shooting which means i'm kind of safe 650 hp which is not a lot a gaze of malice going down I did some friendly fire damage there, but um, not too worried. These guys have armor. The spearmen do not. The uh, broken uh, ground soul fire going down, doing a lot of damage to everything. Cav, uh, chariots, and infantry. At at uh, this stage, um, I think I used some of my circuits of iron uh, with the combination of power of darkness to get some wins of magic back and with the uh, uh, breath attack we break this uh, this uh, artillery piece which is pretty nice some of our dark riders uh, doing their best trying to chase the units of the battlefield malekith is too damaged to uh, get to the ground especially uh, into these many units some of them anti-large let's uh, see how these units are doing uh, we were able to break the Empire Knights and the uh, Jade Wizard but uh, the Grammy Group Knights are healthy 24 models and they're going to be really scary especially after Malekith took this much amount of damage so chasing off the routed units the Amber Wizard is still here uh, standing he doesn't even have a sword uh, but I think my opponent is uh, saving for a um, another summon here saving winds of magic so uh, the steam tank is also pretty damaged my chariot scourge runners are trying to shoot it down 700 hp i think with uh with this much ammo we're gonna be able to deal with it the soul sealer also going down uh, but uh, not hitting the um no it did so yeah it's, it's taking some damage and it lost around 200 hp which is pretty low i'm not sure what happened there and another beautiful shot from the steam tank into Malekith Empire brought its uh, A game to deal with the Druki uh, today. So yeah, pretty scary stuff. 800 HP again. The cannon shots are pretty accurate, but with 10 HP, I think we're gonna be able to deal with the uh, steam tank. Yeah, fortunately, it's gone, but uh, we have a really healthy Walkmar who's still getting his HP back and some really scary demigriff knights so at this stage I know uh, if these guys capture Malekith I'm probably done so I'm sacrificing uh, the scourge and chariots to deal with them a bit and I'm gonna bring some cav units to hold these guys in place while I'll do I do a breath attack so 3000 HP that breath attack did around a thousand HP to these guys uh, so that's pretty nice but overall, I don't have a lot of anti-large remaining. We have these Dread Spears who, who are trying to join. And this is, a, this is a mistake that I'm doing, sending units one by one with each charge and the buffs from Walkmar. Yeah, these guys are just uh, not gonna uh, lose to any of my units here. So I'm bringing my anti-large units. I'm, I'll try, I'm going to try to saturate this Cold One Knights with these Dread Spears, try to deal with the uh, Demigriff Knights who are the biggest threat here some of my units are idle chased some units off the battlefield but i don't think they're gonna be able to do much against 
the uh, the demi group knights and Wolfmar. so yeah but that's a mistake for sure i should have brought them in uh as soon as I, as soon as they finish their chase but here uh yeah i'm trying to save up wins of magic but i don't think i'm going to be able to uh, cast any more soul sealers i think uh, malekith can only cast three four if the battle lasts for 20 minutes i think so yeah my opponent not um i'm um, with not finishing this amber wizard uh, this is a really scary situation here. We have a really healthy Feral Manticore and a bear Breath attack uh, misses uh, nearly all of its uh, shots or um, instances. So that was pretty bad. And with this, I have to bring Malekith down uh, in the air. I'm not safe. And I think the uh, Manticore was able to get its shot in. We lost a lot of HP there. But uh, Malachi is still doing its best, but with another um, grand uh, soul fire, we lost our infantry and a banishment going down. And with that, I think Malachi is dead. And just like that, I think we're gonna uh, we're gonna throw in the towel. Unfortunately, those guys are done as well. So yeah, they're pretty close. So uh, <laughs> yeah, that's the silver lining. Those guys are gonna see their uh Druki family probably <laughs> so yeah let's see the values we were able to accrue on our units malekith 123 kills 17 nearly 80k damage dealt 4100 damage value pretty nice the infantry and uh, not doing the best uh, some of the units did, these two units uh, did pay for themselves the Dark Riders, one of them do great. The Cold One Nice is fine, especially this one. And yeah, the uh, Discursioners were uh, not the uh, best because I, uh, after the game, I remember that I usually bring Shades in this matchup because they're, they're half stock. So the artilleries can shoot them down. You can get uh, close to um, important targets and just shoot them down with their really high uh, missile strength with armor piercing so yeah uh, but really a great game gg to my opponent my first game after the release of warhammer uh, 3 in warhammer 2 we lost but yeah what can i say it was pretty fun so uh, the only units that pay for themselves here i think were the hammer of witches uh, demigriff knights didn't pay for themselves and i don't think any the uh, sim tank also did fine any other infantry was able to do much yeah so we got uh we got destroyed but just just this unit so uh, that's it for this battle guys i hope you enjoyed it if you did i would really appreciate it if you guys consider leaving a like and subscribing it would really help me on my channel grow i also have a discord server uh, i'm just gonna upload uh, warhammer 2 games uh, once a week because uh, as I said I miss the game I really want to play land battles and I think there are some uh, players who still prefer Warhammer 2 to the third installment of the game so yeah I hope I'm not wrong and I hope uh, you guys enjoyed this video guess that's it catch you all later bye